Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, let us go through Java AWT scroll bar, guys. Guys, this is one of the most easiest concept, guys. I hope everyone knows that what is a scroll bar. Whenever you open a file that is nothing but a PDF file, you'll be having on the right side, you'll be having a small shaded thing with it with the gray color, right? So that is nothing but your scroll bar. You can scroll it down or up according to your requirement. If you scroll down, the next pages will be appearing. If you scroll up, the previous pages will be appearing. That's it. So the object of scroll class scroll bar class is used to add horizontal or vertical scroll bars in an GUI component. It is visible. It allows us to see invisible number of rows and columns. Fine. Okay. So once we are excuse me. So once we are going through the example, you'll be having a clear idea. Don't worry, guys. Okay. So basically, initially you'll be initializing or you'll be importing the AWT file. Then you'll be writing a class a scroll bar example. You'll be writing a constructor for that. We have given the frame name here. So we are we have created a scroll bar s equal to new scroll bar. We have set it boundary size, and then we added this uh, scroll bar into our frame. We set it our frame size. We set it our frame to be null, and then we set it our frame visibility to be true. So we wrote public static void main. We have just created the instance of this. So it automatically calls the constructor. So this will be our output, guys. So that is nothing but the scroll bar. It may not be a bit clear, guys. It is something like this. I'll be just drawing the exact diagram with a zoom in. Fine. It is exactly like this, guys. It is shaded with some color. Okay. So like this, it is there, guys. So now I hope everyone is hundred percent clear and familiar with. The scroll bar in awt java guys so in the next tutorial we'll be going through java awt file field guys sorry text field guys thank you thanks for watching